Welcome to another iCAM Foundation tutorial. In this video, you'll learn the launch panel of Jenner Foundation. From 3D Experience, go to Analysis and Output, then select Generate NC Code Interactively. Make sure the NC output type is set to ISO, then go to the NC Code tab. Select the post processor you want to use. Check the Visual Post Processing box and click Execute. This will start the launch panel of Jenner Foundation. From here, you have several options available. The Options button will open the Jenner Options window. In Options, you can change the name and location of the tape or listing file. However, if you change the name or location of the file, it will not automatically import them in 3D Experience when the process is completed. You can also change the tracing options for the listing file. These options include error messages, macros, and more. The CAM button will open the CAM Interface Kit window. From here, you can select a custom interface kit that you have created. By default, the CAM system is automatic. If you have multiple generated versions of the same post, you can select the desired version to use the post process. When launching Jenner, the latest generated version will automatically be selected. The Job button will let you save the current settings of the launch panel into a container file located on your computer. This job file is useful while running Jenner Foundation in standalone mode, 